Hey everyone, Deadbind here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov episode 20 here. This is totally not take two because I accidentally hit stop recording. Um, nope, that didn't happen at all. Anyway, we're hopping on to customs. Hopefully we get the boiler side spawned. Hopefully we can get all the tasks done. We'll see you in the raid. All right. Sorry, I left the music on as well. All right, good. We got this as, during the intro there. I don't know, this is just a, uh, you know, we're one take wonders here. We don't uh, we don't mess around. And by that I mean we mess around a lot and don't really take things very seriously. <laughs> That's what I mean by that. Can you damage that armor in a duo round? Yes. That's that's what Pestle and Red Ops are doing. I'm talking about the uh, the six B. Oh, that actually no, that crafts into Plex. Which we may need relatively soon. Not mean to up. do that. So I need to give. I need to give people time to unlock the rooms and dorms I, or unlock 214 basically in dorms for us and then we have the keys for the skier task and then we also need to give people time to unlock what's his face over there is that a scab or a player Guess there's always a chance that that was a player working on. Oh no, they couldn't be working on shotgun task. It was a double barrel. So I think we're here first. We can get ahead of it. We can maybe cut people off from in here. to consume. It's a Ketter, right? Oh, there's somebody. Could be a person, though. Not just a scav. Feels like a... Feels like a scav. I know that could be warning bell stuff, but experience is experience. JSP stuff is really not terrible. I just, we hardly ever use MP7s. Is that me? 
I don't think that was at me. I think that was at somebody else. And it hit the side near me. MP7 best pistol. It is a really fun pistol to use. <laughs> Although it's actually probably a little bit less good these days. I'm not sure if that's a scab or not. Because the reason it was such a good pistol back in the day is because it was so steady in single fire. But the pistols are so good now with the new recoil. You know, they're they're a little bit more similar. A grenade. I did. Let's see if it's a scab. Okay. May not be a scab. Interesting that there's one in there now. I had to have guessed, I would have guessed that they were in that room, but I heard them walking to the right there, so maybe not. Cam Cole, thank you for the seven stream watch streak. Much appreciated. Maybe they had quest items they were trying to get out with. I don't really know. I mean, they obviously heard me. But yeah, so if you, so that's that's a that's a nice little piece of information for those who are kind of newer, maybe to Tarkov. If you have a grenade and you throw it, and nobody shouts, and you know there's somebody nearby, player. The scavs will always yell. Some sort of Russian grenade, you know, some sort of grenade, but in Russian, you know, or oh crap grenade, or oh they threw a grenade, or you know, whatever. So. Russian grenade sounds. God damn it. Thank you, Cam Cool, for the 369. I don't know how hard it is to play that grenade sound, but it happens immediately. Like it like it happens like instantaneously after leaving your fingers. <sighs> I mean I guess I should have expected that. I guess I should have expected that. I don't know. Oh, parrot. So always check underneath there. Because you can get bitcoins. That spawn under the tarp. Which is nice. Alright, 
we gotta clean up a little bit here. Oh, can this go into there? No. Ooh. Okay, definitely want that. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. So, let's unload you. And not even bother. Let's unload you. What do we not need here? Let's go ahead and drink you, or eat you. Drink you. We don't need you. We don't really need you. This is good money, but like it does take up a lot of room. And like we're not super desperate for money at the moment. That's for the barter we need. We probably have one, but it's you know. Drinking that for sure. So it's it's a couple of these for a regular L C D. Like you can turn those in for a, a working L C D. Um which is why I'm saving these ones. And we are gonna need that for security three relatively soon. So M. Joe sharing that prime. Thank you so much. Let's get some love and hype in the chat, please. Prime subs are such an amazing way to support any content on Twitch. And I seriously appreciate that. For being something we're 12 today, four away from our second set of fireworks on the day. You'll love to see it. Big cheers. And uh, Camp Cool, cheers for the watch streak. And uh, Hohenheim, thank you for the five stream watch streak. Thank you, thank you, both of you. All three of you, rather. I like that, but it's hard to hard to scope. I guess we have the mount for it, though. Where did I get rid of that? Oh, oh, right, the uh, the guy we killed outside probably looted, looted that. We gotta go loot him too. Hey, Samus. Hello. Welcome to the stream. It's good to have you. This is... They probably stopped looting this because they heard me. Got there, maybe? That was a ceiling foam. We would absolutely grab that. That is not. Nah, we don't, we're not going to bother with that, MJ. Whoa. I almost felt like it was from behind. Maybe from there? And this guy has a friend. Oh, there's one other place it could be. I mean, it could be Sniper Scav, I don't know. It could be, um... That window? It's too dark right now. Oh, it really could be Sniper Scav, though. Yeah, it was. Okay. Actually, I had to suppress Mosin. So, 
My route here is to avoid that fight to my left. That's how far they miss, by the way. Starting off. What did you have? A G36, huh? That's pretty cool. Oh, this, this will actually help us a ton. Hopefully. under there that would be nice get rid of that so we can do that that and that full of 855 this is pretty good I think like early game I'm pretty sure this is quite good so maybe, maybe we'll use this a bit Although, if this has a suppressed Mosin, we really should just unload it and, and use our AK. Which would also save us room. Yeah, they do. Yeah, and then that way this guy can have his gun back as well. You know, not that's not the reason to do that, but... Also saves us room, which is nice. The fact that it has a scope is suppressed and it and is suppressed is like a really big deal. Grounds you are done. I tried to get first day wipe, but it was brutal. Now it's much better. Also, night waiting was a good idea. Good. Glad to hear camos. Yeah, I would imagine it would be a lot better, you know, a little bit early, you know, later on. So, good. I'm glad. Have fun uh, playing the game normally. <laughs> well, ammo doesn't come back in insurance anyway, Brutask, so... You know, kind of works out that way. All right, this has been looted. But I am going to check the weapon containers. Oh, they also looted that. What do they have here? DVD player, hard drive? Okay. Deal. This would be good, though. That means somebody came over here. All right, I'll take, I'll take our cigarettes. See if dorms has been taken. No. This is the kill we got. This was a scab, right? Yeah. Sure was. We're kind of looking for gingy keychains here. Give or take. Actually like that that's open that's a good sign that maybe we have everything we need
Oh. I'm just gonna per ditch that because it was uh, illegally looted. But yeah, if this is open, maybe that maybe our 214 will be open. Well, it looks like it. Okay. That was that shotgun shot was in an interesting spot. Seems like they may have looted everything as well. Which I'm A okay with. That engine might have been this G thirty six guy. Hard to say. It's looking for capacitors. Or even a PSU to craft capacitors at some point. I am worried that that shotgun's heading here. Drop that mag, right? Okay. <laughs> this is correct. They were heading here. Player scab, though. Means they can have nice things on them. Sorry, sorry, Mr. Player Scav. Couldn't risk it, you know. Grab the ye old golden, uh, just get a nice ye old golden Zibbo. Was, uh, <clears throat> that may be the thumbnail of this episode. We'll find out. Maybe there's a better one later on. I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know. We'll see. I did want to secure, like, one of those. I guess we're not taking this out. And honestly, we don't really need that grenade. Oh, I could also, like... Oh, I could put that on here. Let's go. Nice. They had something good while they go to dorms. Yeah, but maybe they looted something good in dorms. You know? Hey, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. If you're tuning in for some drops, you're in a good spot. We'll be here for 12 hours. And, uh, you know, if you like Hardcore Tarkov, you're also in a good spot because we'll be playing that for the next 12 hours as well. Yeah. Scary. This dude's got an AKM... With a Bastion with an RK on it? What the heck? Is that worth it over the suppressed Mosin? It might be. And I could also oh yeah, this is this is worth it over the Mosin. We can take this suppressor though. Cause what we can do with this is that that. Can't quite do that, but that saves us room as well. I 
That guy really acted like a player scav. Or as looted like a player scav, but acted like a bot scav. That's pretty wild to me. Alright, good. Nighttime does mean less player scavs. H, by the way, is your helmet light. Yeah, I would always make, I would always double check to make sure your drops are running. You might have to refresh or go there, especially if you've been here before the drop started, I guess. I don't know. They can get weird. I saw that Pestley had Pestley's viewers were having some problems as well. I love the snow. It's so good. This is Magnum shotgun rounds? Yeah, it is. That's pretty cool. I don't like the Magnum shotgun rounds, but honestly, if, if shotguns are, are that kind of poor, these might be necessary. Oh, you might have to remake your account as well. Yeah. So I think I'm going to go get the Zibbo down first, then check. Yeah, I got you, K-Bailey. They're, they're weird. They're definitely weird, right? Like, that's, you know. The fortunate thing is we'll be here for 12 hours. So, you got at least 10 more hours. This, this way first. Because there's also a chance that nobody did open this. You know. A good chance they did. But Thank God you missed. Well, they didn't. that's the case, then we're just going to get the Zippo done and leave because there was a door open. Like, we had the 214 items. And that's really important because we don't have the key for that. So, there's no reason to risk that much. Although, back here should be fine. So we'll see. <sighs> and we could see we could keep working towards the barter for that key as well if we wanted to. I think it's like squash crackers and something. See, that's not good. Oh, no. I 
think it was a player scav. I didn't realize leaning would cancel it. That's a bummer. Positive that was a player scav, though. So, fortunately, we didn't die. Because that would have been awkward. And maybe that's some good stuff. They may have they may have looted all of back there for us, which would have been nice. Or which would be will be nice. Alright. Dying would have canceled the objective, but I would have gotten the objective down. Um if I hadn't leaned. Yeah. I mean, it sells okay. Maybe they had just spawned in. It could have been. A, it could have been a bot scav. All right. Now. You didn't see me. There's no way you saw me. We're not gonna mess with these scavs. We're not gonna worry about it. We're gonna get out here. Donate one kidney and you're a hero. Donate ten and you're under investigation. Uh, what an entrance, Carlos. What an entrance. How are you today? Good morning. All right, GG. Not the four tasks we wanted to get done, but two, two, two tasks done is pretty good, especially one where we don't have a key for, right? Especially one where we don't have a key for. Ugh. <sighs> Definitely good. Plus a ton of experience. And some decent loot. Alright, here we are. Yeah. Pretty good. So these two key these two are done. They're not really worth that one's not worth. This one is actually, I think, worth holding on to. In in like your your key whatever repertoire for, for customs. Because it um it has like some duffels in there and stuff. Like it's it's not if you're completely 100% looting, it's fine, right? Okay, these are all for later. This is to be sold, sold later. I feel like these are needed later for something, but for now we're gonna sell. For now we sell. Same with that guy. These are definitely for later. We, we finished the three dry fuels that we needed to do. Get a few more of those. It's not going on anything relevant anytime soon. These trade for propital, but not worrying about it for now. Not worrying about it. Not worrying about it. I guess we could craft a green battery, actually, with that. Hmm. Not a bad, not a bad place to be at. Okay. I think we're going to sell that, too. Yeah, it's selling the PRS. That stuff's not bad. 855 is actually pretty reasonable. Going to need a bunch of nuts and bolts. This actually might have been the last metal parts that I needed. Yep, I only need one metal parts for now. So, that's a good one to cross off. Satisfying crossing off stuff. Okay, got a fresh AKM, which is pretty sick. Oh, this can get sold. Um... Hair. Well, it needs to be 60%. It's funny how little you have to actually repair. So, oh, this actually might be sellable anyway. Oh, yeah, it was already 60%. Um, but yeah, it's funny how, how little you need there. All right, we need skier money, basically. So whatever skier we'll take, even if it's for a bad deal, we got to go ahead and do that. And then we do want to keep working on Jaeger. Jaeger's the next best, like, rubles, rubles buyer. And then Prepper. So we get a little bit less, but we need money spent on these guys for later on, you know? Okay, Golden Swag is now done. Which unlocks Chemical, which, again, gives us pretty good stuff. So we are on the map, right? Like, there's no reason to not stick around on the map. 
Um, and then we turn in this guy. Beautiful. Look, look how much that unlocks. Look how much that unlocks. It's absurd. It's actually absurd. So I'm not going to hand in the car batteries. We are going to hand in these spark plugs, question mark? Maybe not. Let me check the hideout real quick. Okay. Yeah, because if generator three... Oh, see, so generator three requires spark plugs, so we're not going to hand this in. I would rather get the hideouts done, because this car repair is needed, but not... Like, we can get that after the hideout stuff, you know? Right. Okay. Yep, that's the sawmill one. General wares, we can start turning these in. Nice. And then that one's actually not too terribly hard either. Oh, yeah, that unlocks this guy. Wait, what? Quest not found. Oh, you got it from a loot drop. Yeah, so it's a little bit of rubles, you know. Did not mean to go to the hideout. Looks like it reloads, though. That's interesting. Or sorry, unloads rather, because like I have my, I have my in the settings you can set so your hideout doesn't load. We so have never less. found a cave painting of a salad. <laughs> nice, Carlos. Um, you know, also cavemen didn't li really live very long, and they had probably poor health and a lot of scurvy. So you know. <laughs> but that is kind of funny. I'm sure they ate the plants that they could. They just didn't. They just didn't draw about it. Uh, you made me lose my train of thought, though. Oh, so you can have in the settings that your hideout's not loaded. So when that error happened, it looked like it had me reload the hideout, which is interesting. Okay, 25 scouts on customs. This unlocks some pretty cool stuff, too. So we definitely want to get that one done. That might even be towards Punisher. Oh, no, delivery with bass is either for Punisher, for sure. So, I mean, we are certainly... Um, train of thought here. Needed to go back to customs. 100%. All right, let's also start, start turning these in. Get a better idea. Oh, exactly two of each. Nice. All right, A broke, don't fix it. Hopping back on customs here. As I say, I guess, I guess it's bugged out saying I have these. Yeah. But yeah, custom or scav kills. Definitely stuff something we need. Um, this is we could either use that for looting purposes or honestly just for ammo here is not the worst. Make sure to bring in that. We haven't taken it out yet, but honestly it's it would be nice to do. Okay, unload here, repair here. Um, that can go away. These can all go away. I mean, we have some green tracers to work with now, which is nice. That can go away. We'll do this. Gonna load you up with some BS. BP there. I have more BP somewhere. I do not have more BP somewhere. Okay. Fair. Do I want to bring that? I don't even know if I want to bring that. We'll do that. No, that should be good. We'll save that for later. Two grenades is a lot, but it's fine quite like the STM9. It's probably going to be really good um, in this current new recoil era. We'll just put that away there. And honestly, like this little compact on this STM9 is prob probably pretty good. Okay. Let's... Um, we're not taking any keys in, I don't think. Or we don't need any keys, right? I guess we could bring in a safe key. Do we need to go to dorms for any reason? No. So we're better off just avoiding dorms, actually. Okay. 
yeah. So we're better off just avoiding dorms because we don't we don't need it. Like, I guess we'll we'll bring the money just in case we're like wanting to get out as soon as possible. But like, I yeah, I don't think we need to do dorm stuff. All right, we have splint, we have that, we have painkiller, we have that. I, I guess we could just CMS then, and just put these here. Okay. Uh, and do I have any liquids to? We have this EWRs, but I really would rather save those for meds. Those are just to lay with kits in my mind. So no, we do not have any meds or things to drink. We can find them in raid pretty easily. Okay. Good stuff. We're good there. I will. Is it more likely to be opened at nighttime or daytime? I think it's actually more likely to be opened at nighttime. Let's try a nighttime raid just to... Because that's when people go to get their tasks done. So I think it's going to be more likely to be opened then. From somebody who's just like, I'm fed up with PvPing there. I want to get my task done. Let's let's try it. Let's try it. See you, man. Okay, late spawn is late. So this one's interesting. I think we're going to do our best to... To loot here quietly because I want somebody to come up in front of us and open this for us and I don't want to kill them you know but this also may be just uh, we loot and leave and like maybe just go get our skier task done type of raid you know pretty common to have everybody kind of chill out on customs for the first, you know, bit of this is what the old school start used to look like, right? Looks like all this is new here. There's also some decent loot to be had here as well. Hey, Freddy with the five-day watch streak. Thanks so much. Uh, YouTube, seriously, thanks so much for tuning in as well. <sighs> Ooh, I made that strong. Not complaining. Love strong coffee. But that is some bold flavor. You can find cigarettes on these two crates there. If you didn't know. I believe this is the shelf that can have CPU parts on it. I haven't heard any shooting over in there, so <clears throat> either no scav spawn and they opened it, that would be ideal scenario, or nobody's coming back for it. But like I said, we could get our skier task done here. That wouldn't be the worst thing. Oh, there we go. That's potential. Well, those are all pretty good. Yeah, duffel bag, duffel bags may be our kind of new caches here. They really can kind of have everything in them. Absolutely delightful. Smells well enough. I think I am already starting to try to save for stash three. Like, we could really rush stash three here. the moment. But maybe somebody will be coming through. Like I said, I think we'll be patient on this. Because maybe those people are fighting their way here. You know? Hall, let's go. I really appreciate the fact that they have, like, 
wherever the snow forms, they have the ability to put the snow texture onto the items as well, you know? I, I know that's probably not that necessarily ne that hard mechanically, but I appreciate that they made that, that a thing. Like, even the items you loot, you know? I don't know. One of the little details. Okay. This trash for sure can have some good stuff spawned in it, like green batteries and stuff. That's the mounted gun. I think. You like that the actual the snow is actually crunchy sounds? I agree. I agree. <laughs> I just, I find that, I find this mag so amusing. I shouldn't, but I find it so dang amusing. I really do. Um, and this is, this is not terrible. Maybe we could start kidding out one of those ADARs with that. Right? I'm pretty sure that's the mounted gun. That's interesting. Yeah, the hundred rounders, I just find it so silly. Uh, I think I... Do I don't I need one of those? Maybe not. Okay, I think this one's ever so slightly... Better. Technically, I need that for a task as well. Yeah, we'll hang on to it for now. It's, it's a... I think it's just a wreck battery trade, but like... This raid doesn't have much else in it, and we get our tasks and get out. Like, it's probably going to get dished on the ground, but, like, maybe it doesn't. Yeah. Did I get this room, too? I mean, I didn't, but there wasn't really anything great in here. We could start saving up for a blue fuel bar uh, craft, I guess, with these. I think I just did that room here. Yeah. So we could literally sit here and watch the uh, door. See if somebody comes up and opens it. I mean, I don't care if we, they die or whatever. I, we kill them, all that. I just, all I care about is that they open it for us. I guess we didn't loot the blue car. Let's go loot the blue car. I can't believe they have BS rounds right now. I find that silly. Uh, we had a few friends over. And honestly, it was super chill. Super chill. Uh, it was really, it was more like f uh, friends and a fa and family. So they, there was two, there was two little kids there. One well, was more of a toddler, but um, it was mostly just hanging out with with them. And everybody went home by nine, <laughs> which was nice. Yeah, that's not gonna be a very important key. You, those are your favorite. You did the same. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's actually the reason some of the families came is because they were like, oh, a party or a thing, a social interaction, but we don't have to stay till midnight? Done. Because <laughs> we, we said when we were inviting people, it's four to nine, you have to leave. <laughs> so I think that's actually the reason some people came, which, I, which I'm totally okay with. It's so good. Um... But uh, yeah, all right. Let's get to an egg where we can actually see that. And I might. What am I do, YouTube? I might chill out with Twitch chat here. I've never, I've never really done this before, but I might chill out with Twitch chat here because this area is rel is relatively safe.
and just keep an eye on the door in the shadow from the shadows here and just kind of just wait you know i think i might just kind of wait here i wonder if you can get up here more easily now hold on let me, let me we'll show you this trick first Because someone might be marking these containers as well here. I don't know. Were they not? They may have removed this ability. They may have removed this ability. That's okay. We'll go AFK in here. But yeah, I'm actually gonna pause in the middle of a raid for the first, like the first time ever in this. I think it's, I think it's worthwhile. I think it's worthwhile saving some time here. I'm literally just going to be sitting here, and I will unpause as soon as I hear or see anything. You know? I think we'll go chill out right here. Yeah, we should be able to see. Hold on, maybe... You know when you're old when your idea of a night out is sitting on the patio. Game kind of locked up there for a second. But yeah, I'm literally going to sit here. And uh, I'll, uh, I'll unpause you when anything happens. Okay, we heard a gunshot that might be closer on this side. So we might have some action here in a second. Or somebody opening up the door, hopefully. So I decided I'm going to give it till 20 minutes. So it was at 29 when we when we paused. So I'm going to give this until 20 minutes, basically. But I'm hoping that that gunshot was somebody taking out a scav and is going to be going in here. Okay, so it is... We're at 20 now, but I just heard some more AK fire somewhat close here so maybe somebody finally made their way across so i'm going to give it a little bit more time but we're, we are going to have to you know kind of barrel across the the way here um so i'm going to give it a little bit more time i don't feel as bad waiting like this when it's just twitch chat and i and i'm not like wasting youtube's time so we're going to keep waiting see what this ak fire gives us and then i'll give it till 15 we'll go from there okay yeah i was hoping we were going to hear more ak fire but I think we're just going to say not this raid, and that's okay. So let me know what you think about that, YouTube. I mean, we just saved basically 13 minutes of your time. I literally sat there and did nothing. So. Twiddle my thumbs, if, if you will. Say, can you not vault that? We did do something. I mean, we talked in chat, but we didn't do any gameplay. Well, yeah, let me know. Let me know if that's like something you want to see. The riveting, the riveting content of sitting around and doing nothing. YouTube, you know. Oh, yeah, that's important. Jeez Louise, that double was insane. It's another mag box. Or, you know, ha half of another mag box there for us. Conversing something. I meant I meant nothing in game. I meant nothing in game, chat. Guess you're killing me. No. Those are those are good, but I just we don't have room to store that kind of stuff right now. Maybe when we get our first weapon box. Decent money. I know I should be more all about the Bastions, but... I gotta, I gotta keep searching pockets. I might have to ditch this, because we can get keychains. I mean, money's good, too, but... No worries, Jake. I'm sorry. The, I'm sorry the hotel internet sucks so much, but we'll be here all day, so if you get better internet, you know. But either way, I appreciate you stopping by and uh, saying hi and Happy New Year. Hmm. 
Wrong secrets. Yeah, no worries, Carlos. <coughs> we'll catch you soon. Have a good uh, dog walk. So I guess everybody got it. Right. What now that RUAF is a thing that's always open, like people tend not to come back back here to extract. You know. Which is totally fine, but Turn this SKS into weapons parts, which I wouldn't hate. Oh, stop shaking. There you go. Oh, I saw a laser there. Oops. So somebody's got a TT pistol. Uh, so scavs, when bot scavs loot. They throw the rig on the ground as well. And the reason I do it is, well, it's, it's force of habit from olden times. So a rig on the ground you can control click items over to. That might have been the AK we heard, actually. Um, oh, it's the wrong. It's the wrong grip, though. It would be nice to have, I guess. Um, so like, so I can control click over in now. And this is what I should do: is I should ditch their bag, then control click over to to take their rig. But um. I don't know. And like I said, in the olden days, you couldn't do that. So throwing it on the ground lets you search it and click everything over as opposed to drag everything over, which is significantly faster. And then easier, it makes it easier to pick stuff up. So that's why I do it. But everybody might have, might have different reasons, right? Is it 74U? No, that's not the right grip. I think we start saving up on those. Alright, sorry, banana mag, I need more room. Somebody did this task, which is interesting. There's no way this place has not been looted, right? I guess we'll give it a once over, because finally cabinets for cords and wires would be good. But you never know, sometimes the most random places are just not looted. I should make a plan, though. We have limited time here, so I really should make a plan on, like, what we're actually getting rid of. Like, you can go away. We're drinking you. You can kind of go away. These are all needed. Um, like I said, this can go away. That can go away. Oh, that can go into there. That's nice. Keeping that. Unload. Unload. Okay. Yeah. So we'll do it that way. So we can loot a little bit, a little bit faster here. Uh, squash to trade.
morphine there, but I think we're okay. There's our red timer. I think what we'll do is we'll prioritize jackets. Um, scab bodies. Oh, and a horse. Let's go. Gold spawns, which is a reason to check there. Um, the boulder of intel spawns. Uh, you know what? The blue tape crafts us wire or crafts us hoses, which we do need. Uh, filing cabinets. There's a folder of intel. Once again, they don't feel that rare, These this wipe, so I don't know. I'm not really sure on that, that whole thing. You know? But, I mean, I'll take it. It's less, less work for us. Yes. No. Sugar can go. We do have a distance to go here, so we do have to be a little bit careful on time. Yeah, we should go. Okay. I'm not gonna bother with that stuff. Forgot because I have to go around. I have to go around the long way here. There could be a lot of scabs up. I'm trying to be the fastest way over there. And also the path of least resistance over there. I think it's here. Yeah, we should have, we should have definitely left that twenty. But I think we'll be okay here to get the skier item and get out. You know. Trying to try not to make my dude run out of breath here. I think if I have my normal jump, that's okay, but there's a delay on the jump because of um vaulting. Which is why I think Pestily has it, you know. Has his set a certain way. That's okay. That's almost always looted, but there, there could be green batteries there. Uh, which is really nice. Problem is these these could be attracting all of the uh, things here. Is that an AKM? Oh no, it's a DPO. It's 
So the nice thing is we'll be able to go out and around and then come back and take this this extract. So it should take less time. Hopefully we can avoid all the scavs aggroing to where we shot. That'll be convenient. And then yeah, maybe we maybe we have to go for the um oh, you know what? Let's get let's hit these two computers for cords, capacitors, PCBs. Etc. Wires. Yes. All right, just money for now. Sorry, nice guy. Alright, so skier item right up in here. Oh, you know what I forgot to do on I forgot to make a community post on YouTube. I'll do that. For sure. Alright, this can be in a few different spots now. And I actually forget where all the spots oh there it is. I forget where all the spots are. Don't want, to, don't want to fleece that badly. Okay, and our extract right here, which looks like it's been opened up and looted, most likely, but sometimes not. Also, what I consider a good bullet, what other people consider a good bullet is definitely two different things. That's hardcore. Those are, those are, those are pretty bad. <laughs> Technically okay, but we don't have room for it, and that's okay. Alright, so... Mission success, to some degree. I was really hoping somebody would uh, open up our, our door for us. Um... So we might get held up there. So maybe we do need to go daytime. I don't know. I don't really know. We will see. Okay. Also looks like our 60 is done as well. It's pretty good. Oh, we got some scabs. We Oh, we need scab kills for the uh, the the 25 kills, which that does unlock something. I can't remember what it is. But that, is, that, is, that does gain us from something. I think it's maybe ice cream cones. Maybe. So. We will see. We will see. Okay, so, this is playing out uh, loud in my work course, they kill scabs on like ice cream cones, and I'm not going to give them context. <laughs> That's pretty funny. That's actually really funny, yeah. <laughs> I mean, we have another, one of our other ice cream cones, aka the 60 rounder mags, uh, did craft there, so. That's something, alright, what key do we get here? Oh, it's literally a machinery key. We never we never found one because I it was just open for us. <laughs> okay. Required search here. It's for this key. It's two squash, four crackers, two green teas. Okay, so maybe we can get this going. It's also not a bad key to have. So, yeah. I'd be pretty happy with that. Uh, so we only need a cat now. As well, in order to get what we need. Okay, one one of each cigarette for for that. This is definitely a cell. Different key. This is definitely a cell. Um, hmm. Would you believe I already ran out of space? 
Uh, yep. Yep, for now. They may be on the chopping block later. Okay. So what I'm going to do for this guy is we're probably going to keep this, keep this, sell this. I guess we could also use, we could use this one for our task, but we can use this one for our task as well. And this is a, yeah, as long as it's a beat up one, I, I, I'm good with that. And then we can save all the fresh ones for use because they're actually pretty good. We can save them for Punisher part uh, three. Okay, so let's get this stuff sold. And then who are we working on? We're working on Skier. And then, who's the next most important? Probably Prapper. After that. I guess Jaeger gives us more money. What is this from? Oh, I never received all those. Okay, as long as they're found in Raid, that means they came from a task, so we can take that. I guess I just... Maybe that's what bugged out earlier. Huh. Okay. Um, and then... Didn't I complete a task there? Oh, no. Yeah, I got this. Done. And then chemical part two gives us our 220 key back. Which we can do. I mean, getting the chemical series done will be good. That's our injector case. Um, for sure. So we'll leave that there. Okay. We need 8.5 million for our next hideout upgrade, by the way. So we're, you know, don't hold your breath on that. Don't hold your breath on that one. All right. But now we have more to do in a raid, which is nice. Let's see what we got here. We probably have a lot of random stuff here. Just going to put those away. Uh, we're just going to use... this so we'll bottom load with that and then we'll um okay that's good and then honestly we'll just make those that and we'll top up that perfect perfect Okay, uh, I think we're gonna put. I think we're gonna push through on this episode. Like I said, these later episodes, I say later. It, we're on episode twenty of probably almost two hundred, <laughs> but um, hopefully, hopefully we get less than two hundred. But I do want to start pushing them to be a little bit longer. Like we're in this phase of the people who are still watching it are generally more committed at this phase. So hopefully you're committed. I don't know. It, it's all good though. Like I said, you don't have to watch these all at once keep watching the playlist the playlists are a big deal they really help out but i wanted to keep like the first you know couple episodes a little bit shorter to you know attract new attract new folks into the chat channel and maybe have them you know watch over time here but now we're in the you decided to watch this series we'll make the episodes a little bit longer type of thing you know so all right good stuff let's hop back on customs um yeah i'm not sure i'm not, i'm genuinely not sure on this one but uh i'll see y'all right all right, we're in. Don't like this spawn. But. Well, we'll give it a shot. So what we'll do is we'll head here. Loot up here. Swing over to dorms. And then uh, go from there. And just hope that somebody opens it up for us. That's Sniper Scab, by the way. Who's shooting there? Yeah. 
Damn, GG. GG. I thought I had him on that first spray. I actually stopped shooting there because I was like, oh, cool, headshot. GG, GG, GG. We were about to lose that kit eventually. We we have had that kit for a very, very long time. <clears throat> and they went for legs too, which I find interesting. What they have? Oh, yeah. yeah they went for legs. And honestly, the the um having a blacked out leg is kind of what got me there too. So, GG. My shots. Should have ADS'd. Should have ADS'd. Okay. I mean, we're going to do that again. I just get, we got to figure out our kit, you know? Okay. What do we have here? Oh, just random messages from Skier? Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Put that on, maybe? Yeah. Okay, you, you. You. Am I selling that? I don't think so. I think we'll wear that. What are we using here is the question. Always the question there. Could use this STM-9. Could use this AKM. I think I'm going to save that for Punisher. I think we're closer to Punisher than we think. <clears throat> Could just use this as is. Could also use this guy. Yeah, I would like to be able to put a flashlight on there without having to use up that thing. Um, can I suppress anything else, I guess, is the other question. Can't use that. We could 5-7 suppressed. Suppressed is just easier to get your stuff done, you know? Or can be a lot easier to get your stuff done. have that yeah, it's kind of a no I guess we could also just not go in suppressed also depends on whether I barter for that armor or not as well I guess I guess we're gonna have a level three armor here so trading prepper barter you and we have another backup which is nice so that's really good Could do Mosin pistol. I don't think this one can have. Yeah, this one can't have the the thing though. Uh, but it might be able to have the. Nope. I was thinking maybe it could have the uh, the the other grip on it, but I guess not. Okay, I think STM nine it is then. Uh, I do need to save one big stick. We don't need to worry about that, I don't think. I could have swore I came out with an Osprey supp suppressor at some point, but I guess not. Okay. Like I said, we'll try to save that for the Punisher. And what do we have here? We've got a million Green Tracer... Um, I don't hate the idea of, like, top-loading. Potentially. So maybe, maybe we're not top-loading with the PSO, though. Let's do that. With that, and then that, and then honestly, we're going to keep a bunch of that green tracer in our pockets, because, and even maybe some PSO, because we can, we can really rip through ammo quickly with this thing, like really quickly, so, and then meds, so four, I don't have any bandages, do I, it's not looking like it. We are done with these. We can put that on. Well, no, we want, we want a better one. Okay. 
Yeah, no, that should be good enough. And then we'll do four, five, six. And then like this. To kind of keep us going. Okay. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, now, YouTube, that's going to be next episode. Um, we're going to hop on to customs. Try to get this thing done. Hopefully, this hopefully we don't die because we're using the STM9. But uh, you got to have some fun, right? We got to have some fun with our uh, with our kits here. Um, but, uh, yeah, thanks so much for tuning in. Thanks for watching all the way through. Really appreciate those who do. Thank you for subbing the channel. Twitch chat, don't go anywhere. We're not. Uh, we're, we're streaming for 12 hours, Twitch chat. So don't, don't worry about that. This is just the end of the YouTube episode. Um, yeah, hopefully we can get through uh, through these customs uh, tasks. But we could also we could also take a break from that and just go farming for loot as well uh, whenever we want to. So there's there's no I would like to get these things done because we are going to need mechanic level two that sort of thing. Um, but we also don't have to. We can we can we can go and do other stuff. So yeah. Anyway, YouTube, thanks for tuning in. We'll catch you in the next episode. Bye bye.